Okay, hi you guys, my name is KK Lay. I'm from Westminster, California, and today I'm gonna show you guys my red vegetable hummingbird flower, it, it bloom. So these are very, it's edible flower, one of the edible flower, they have, they come in white and red. So this one of mine is red, and you can saute with beef, or you can put it in hot pot, or, or saute them, it's really good. So why does it call vegetable hummingbird? And this come in red and white, so I have the red one. See, it looked like a hummingbird. That's why it's called vegetable hummingbird. It hang like that, see? So it has it, and this is grow in Westminster, California, and then I have some more tiny one, see? And then I have some more flower one. So this time I probably sauteed it a little bit with beef, or I can put it in hot pot. It's really delicious, it's edible. This whole part is edible, see? And this is the red, it's called red, it come in white and red, so this one is called red vegetable hummingbird. There's another scientific name, but it's it's very hard to pronounce. It's called Sabasinion, uh Gardiflora something. It's really hard to pronounce, so I'm just gonna call it red hummingbird because it hang. It does look like a hummingbird. It's cute, huh? So happy growing and eating, you guys. Let's turn our, our backyard into an edible backyard, okay? And I live in Westminster, California. My zone is 10B. 10B. So, growing them like that.